<clears throat> Hello. How are you today? Hi, hi. Hi, teacher. How are you today? I am, but fine. Excellent. How was your vacation? Did you have vacation? One day, only Friday. Only Friday. Oh my God. That was very, very short. What yeah. about the others? Did you have vacation? Yes. 15 September only. Uh -huh. Hello. Hello. You are in business, right, David? You are in business. Yes. That's why you don't have vacation. Yes, and my distribution in the yeah. in the, the our other country. Mm -hmm. So that's no way to have vacation, right? Yes, and no, I don't have vacation. Oh, my God. That's so sad. Well, let's see. We are, hmm, thanks. We can start, we're 10. Hey, Adriana, Sofia. Present. Nice. Analicia. Ana. Ana Grisel. David. Present teacher. Diego Batres. Edwin Mauricio. Present teacher. Estaré una hora más o menos de oyente. Tengo que terminar un trabajo. Ok, David. <clears throat> Edwin, right. Elda Cristina. Present teacher. Elmer Fabricio. <coughs> Elmer Fabricio. Grace Michel. Present teacher. Ivonne Marcela. Ivonne, no. Jennifer Elizabeth. Jennifer Elizabeth, Jessica, Jose Alberto. Present teacher. Jose, okay, Jose Alberto. Karen Janet. Present teacher. Carla Lorena. <clears throat> Carla Lorena. Lisa Dayanara. Lisa Dayanara. Nubia Zulema. Present teacher. Rebeca Marcela. Present teacher. Rosa Hilda. Present teacher. Ok. Víctor Manuel. Present teacher. Karen Stephanie. Karen. Adriana Marcela. Present teacher. José Alfredo. José Alfredo. No. Ok. Bueno. <clears throat> Let's see somebody who that was not here when I called you. Uh, Analicia. Ana Grisel. Diego. Elmer Fabricio. Ivon Marcela. Jennifer Elizabeth. 
Carla Lorena, Lisette Dayanara, Karen Stephanie, José Alfredo, no, bueno, nadie. Ok, bueno. Ok. Well, I'm going to share the presentation for today. Eh, we go to class number, number six, right? Class number six. Oh, I'm going to share for everybody. Okay. Here we are. Uh, welcome after vacation, right? If you had a vacation, that's nice. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you had fun and rested, right? Okay, check. Uh, we have, uh, this is our video conference number six. And today we are going to be talking about the strategies for testing new products, right? We're going to have the conversation and we are going to talk about testing new products. Why testing? What are the reasons for testing? What is the importance of testing a new product? And at the end, you will uh, give a summary of what are strategies, what are the strategies for testing products, right? Well, let's look at this uh, discussion. Have you ever heard the term product testing? There are two primary tests, uh, types of tests to evaluate a product. One, the site and handling. The other one, test and the use test, yeah? The site and handling test and the use test. And then you will discuss with your partners what you know about them, right? We are on, hmm, we are on your manual, page 17. There you have, <coughs> sorry. There you have the questions that we are going to be discussing. Okay. Ready, ready for that? Sorry, mm -hmm. what page? 17. 17. Page 17. The, the questions that we have at the beginning. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Those are the questions we have at the beginning. The site and handling test and the use test. That's what you're going to discuss. So have you ever heard the term product testing? Have you ever heard that term, product testing? And then you will discuss about the types of tests to evaluate a product, right? There we go. I'm going to send you in groups for you. Hola, to... Hola teacher. Hi. Buenas noches. Voy a estar de oyente al menos la primera hora que apenas voy saliendo. Okay, José Alfredo. Nice. <clears throat> teacher. Hi, Carla. Present. Me acabo de conectar, no me podía conectar. Oh, okay. Maybe because of the rain, Carla. Maybe. It has been raining cats and dogs, right? That's the expression you use. It's raining cats and dogs. In Spanish, we say, están lloviendo sapos y culebras, right? <laughs> but in English, no. In English, it's cats and dogs. Hi, Yvonne, Marcela. Hi, teacher. Hi, hi. Teacher, me acabo de conectar también. Okay, okay. 
pero present. <laughs> excellent, excellent. Yeah, it has been raining cats and dogs everywhere. Okay, well, we're going to make groups. I'm going to make four groups for you to go discuss about the questions that we have there. Um, hmm. Let me see that I don't want to have all the oyentes in the same group. Oh. Okay. <coughs> Bye, there we go. <coughs> Join a group and discuss the questions. Try to join Jose Alfredo, Edwin, Yvonne. Try to join a room. Esta hora siempre levanta calumnias. No, no calumnias, solo que la mayor parte del tiempo le dice a la teacher que está trabajando, pero mentira. No, cuando le digo, te estoy trabajando porque estoy trabajando. Y no, hoy aquí estoy. Son bromas, pues vaya, va a quedar grabado así, no voy a hacer. Ajá. Te va a crecer. Va okay. a dejar en evidencia, sin querer. Así que no, yo no he dicho nada, ¿ok? Más control Z. Ok. Bueno, have you ever heard the term product testing? We are the answer the three questions, the page number 16, right? 17. Oh. 17. 17, yes, 17. Uh -huh. uh, Excellent, Rose. Siempre comparto, la mayor parte del tiempo comparto. La era, la era. Okay. This, have you ever heard the term product testing? There are two primary, oh, ¿cómo se pronunciará? Primary, primary. Primary, primary type of test to evaluate a product. The side and test. Uh -huh. But first, discuss the first question. Have you ever heard the term product testing? Yes. Just me? Yes. Huh? It has to be, yes, I have been here about third. Uh, repeat, please. I don't understand. I I have It has to be, I have been heard or, or I have heard. I'm confused. 
let me see. Uh -huh. Yes, I have heard about the term product testing. I have heard. Uh -huh. I have heard. The term. The term product testing. Mr. Bellis. Y alguien va a ser Mr. Ayala y Mr. Ávila. Miss Ayala y Mr. Ávila. Hi, you're not in the conversation yet. You're discussing the questions in number one. Let's start questions. Okay. Discuss the questions first. No, we're not in the conversation yet. Oh. Okay. Okay. Have you ever, has anybody of you have heard about the product testing? Alguien ha oído acerca de las pruebas de producto? You don't need to translate, they understand. Que I don't understand, okay. teacher. <laughs> Question. Yes. Question. The is the term no no uh -huh, the term by product see, testing uh uh I don't know what is a test test mm -hmm. what is a, a test a, um? a, a kind of a uh, proof mm -hmm, mm -hmm, exactly Have you ever heard the term product testing? No, yes, I am. Mm -hmm. I and, have... No, I don't. I uh, in the in my before job, sería teacher. In my previous job. Your no. previous job. My previous job. Uh, we used to make a uh, testing product testing. Uh, I was in a final in plant and empaque. How do you say? A packing. Mm -hmm. Some oh, packaging. Uh -huh. Packaging. Uh -huh. uh, so uh, when uh, arrive uh, new products, when we new have products, to, when new when products, new products arrive, arrive, when new products English. arrive. Don't think yes. it's uh -huh. <laughs> exactly. English. We we make a testing how the product is it has to be in the boxes and in the correct way in the boxes. Mm, that's not product testing. Yes, it is because we have a uh, sorry, yes, it is because we uh -huh. have a uh PO uh order production. I don't remember what is the definition of PO. But we call it a PO. So in the PO said all the instructions for the product. So mm -hmm. we have to make the new product and sampling like the order. Okay. So it, but when, did you did you use the product after ensembling the product? Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We we use it. Okay. So that was the way that we that you uh, tested. Yes, that we test because if the product uh, in the boxes has a lot of space uh, sobrante. Empty. Como? Empty. Empty, uh, empty space. You have to notify to notify to the to notify at the a corresponding department to make the modification and all the production stop and that was a big 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 chaos. Mm -hmm. And the how it is is like a 
is is like um how <clears throat> or how can I use the new product? It may be an example of that can be in the industry uh -huh. when they elaborate the products so they check every product and they pass a quality quality test I guess. Ah, yeah. mm -hmm. in my case i know i know her the same and handling this and and they use this yes but uh, i know the i is it? we use uh, the term the term the term <laughs> uh, the and Functionality, functionality testing is a uh, is when the product is finished and the user using the the, the applications so are final in this case. Okay. So what did no. They are two. For example, mm -hmm. in the supermarket. What type of test is that at the supermarket? Testing food? No, testing, no tasting. Yeah. It's not the same, right? Sí, no, o sea, degustar, testing. Or tasting a taste in the food but what type of test will be that one sight and handling or use test mm. we talk about um licuadora como se dice a blender blender a blender maybe uh, maybe used to uh, Picar hielo. Mm -hmm. And the, the blender maybe not uh, have the capacity for, for this. Uh -huh. Uh, uh -huh. I, uh, we will see the handling is different, the, the use. Which do you think is better? Depending on the product, right? Um, it's better for me a handling mm -hmm. uh, for the correct manner. You can see the product, you can check it, handle it, right? Mm -hmm. To see everything mm -hmm. about the product, okay. But protesting is when uh, when the company shows the product. That's the launching. Mm. That's the launching. Uh, for example, <clears throat> when they launch the product, they demonstrate how it works, right? Uh -huh. Yes, but uh, before launching the product, companies uh, use different ways of no of uh, to know if the product is in good condition, if it will be what the customers really want, mm -hmm. if it will last uh, the time that it should last, and they can. How can I say? They, they in the company, inside the company, before launching the product, they make different proofs of different tests, right? And 
they check if the product is, imagine you're, you're talking about tires. So they have to check if they are good enough for running all the different types of streets, right? So what they do is that they use it. They can use the, the, the tire to go for a run in a difficult street or in the company, they can sit and they can handle the, the tire, manipulating it in a very rude way. So they make sure that that tire really works and that it won't be uh, damaged when going to the street, right? That's that's part of, of, of testing. But depending on the product is the type of the strategy that you can use, right? The different type of, of exam or, or test, depending on, on the product. Mm -hmm. Could be a microwave. A microwave oven, yeah. Or a fryer. And product testing can, can be in, for example, in a television. Yes. Any mm -hmm. product can be tested. Any product. Mm -hmm. Yes, any product. And it will depend on the product, the type of test that you use, right? To see how it works, if it really does uh, what is expected that it that it does, right? But the only way is testing the product before you launch it, because what happens is that if you do not test it, it will give you problems when it is in the in the client's hands. Remember last week, well, before vacation, we were talking about uh, products that have been recalled right and it's because they were not tested correctly and then they give problems when they are in the client's hands that's why a test in the product is so important well i'm going to call you now so we got this course together right see there we go let's go mm -hmm. Okay, let's see, how many are we here? Not everybody. Okay. Who wants to share? Have you ever heard the term product testing? Yes, yes. Have you ever heard the term product testing? Hi. Any, Hi. Anybody? Hi. Else? Have you ever heard the term product testing? Yes, no teacher, never in the life. Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Mm -hmm. What what is product testing? What is it? Product testing. Okay. It's an analyze for the one product mm -hmm. to see a characteristic 
function. Mm. I don't know. <laughs> okay. Uh, how do you say uh, complete expectativas? If they comply with the expectations. Expectations. Okay. Mm. Okay, anybody else? Another volunteer? Okay, it's uh, like the same word uh, express is a test of the product uh, that is going to, to launch to the market. Uh, I have participated in some uh, product testing a uh, specific with time and handling. Uh, okay, I don't know if it is if this is the correct method, but I I this this test is when you have in front the product and you are going to check the the package, the size. Um, color of the package, and um, how is the presentation to the to the market? Okay. Uh, uh, after that, uh, the the use of the product uh, in case in this case was a product um, a full a full product. So uh, the test was about the the taste the the, the uh, yeah the taste um smell and uh, the flavor of that okay and there are different types of tests right later on we will be talking about that so check we have another question it says there are two primary types of tests to evaluate a product. So there are six types, but the, like, the most important we can say are these two, the sight and handling test and the use test. What do you know about the sight and handling test? What do you know about it? Mm -hmm. What do you know about the sight and handling test? Somebody? Nobody? I never he heard about those uh, kind of product test, product testing, mm -hmm. but yeah. I think uh, is the way that you have uh, the vision for uh -huh. the product and the way that you that you handle uh, as the word said uh, so you 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 have you have the idea and you mm, i don't know you create as you think i don't know okay when you use the site and handle test check this one um I don't know if you like to watch those types of programs that are about how some things were you were done, right? There are programs where they they show you the way a product was done and then how they test the product and they check the the characteristics as Victor mentioned before. If the characteristics that the product is supposed to have are really there in the product. And as we were talking with Carla and, and Edwin, we were saying that sometimes, uh, imagine you have a car, right? Or you want to buy a car, you want to see the quality of the car. The best test you can use in that case is this one, the use test, right? because you want to see the, 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 the car in action. You want to see the car running. You want to see how it works. So you, for that, you use it. 
when you handle, you just touch it. You touch it and see it. That's why sight comes from see and handling comes from touching, right? So you see the product and you touch it. For example, if you're going to buy, imagine I'm going to buy a box. I just come, I see it and I touch it. Huh? It's very soft. It's very, mm, yeah, I like it, but I'm not using it, right? I'm not going to use it. I'm just going to check it, see it and handle it, right? So depending on the product that you have, that's the type of test that you need to do. So that's one. Uh, I was watching a program where they were making uh, shoes, well, sneakers, right? For people to do exercise, for athletes, for uh, people who like who play any, any sport. And they were pulling and stretching the, the sneakers. So they were using the sight and handling. They were manipulating them in a very rude way because they wanted to see how strong the product was because they are uh, supposed to last a lot, right? So that way, when you use this, uh, this type of test, you see if the product will really work as it is supposed to, right? How strong are those sneakers? But the only way that you can know is handling them or manipulating them you, in a very rude way to see if at the end they will do what they, were, what they are supposed to do. Another, the, the other test, the use test. Um, when I saw that type of test, what came to my mind was the movie, What Women Want. Have you seen that movie? Lo que quieren las mujeres. Have you seen that movie? No? Watch it. No? Yes, I see it. Okay. So what happens in that movie, Carlita, do you remember? The actor there is Richard Gere. What does yes. he do with the products? Unfortunately, I cannot show you here like the piece where he's using the products. First, he does this sight and handling. He receives a box with different products. He gets cera para depilarse, stockings, nail polish, and some lipstick, I guess is the other one but some kind of makeup. He's a man, but he doesn't want to stay behind of women. So as he he's there and he wants to demonstrate that he also tests or checks, well, tests, we can say, the product to be able to give a good response about the product, he has to use them, right? So first he starts with the sight and handling uh, test. He takes the things and he checks them, but he tells his boss, and what am I supposed to do with this product? And she says, use them, use them. So he has to go for this and has to go for the use test. And he starts, Wearing the stockings. Well, first he started using the cera, right? And peeling. And he was like, ah, 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 because it hurts a lot. Then he put on the stockings. He used the nail polish. He used the lipstick. And he started using all the products that he received in the box because he was using this, right? And what happens later, that's another story, right? But what is important there is that in the movie, they are, they are showing you that you have a product, 
you have to taste to test it. That is something very important because if you do not test the product, later on you will have problems like the ones we were talking about two weeks ago, remember? When we were talking about products that are recalled from the market and they are collected, right? And they, when the companies have to take the products out of the market, yes? So to avoid that, to avoid that situation is that companies have to make use of these two tests. Yeah. Okay, now you know something about the two tests, which imagine I'm going to tell you a product and you tell me what you think is the best test for that product. For example, we talk about coffee. Coffee, what would be the best test for that product? Hmm? How would you know if that coffee is the best? How? Which test? The use test. The use test. Use test, right? Yeah. So you have to start making your own cup of coffee to try it then you use the product can i start with this hmm? seeing the bottle manipulating it checking it everywhere reading all the specifications but that's not test right we, we start you, uh, manipulating the product, we start with the test, right? Okay, I'm going to tell you another product. Um, I have a, a dress, a nightgown, right? That's a dress for a party, for your graduation party. How would you test the product before buying it? How? Mm -hmm. First, the signing handling test, but after that, uh, the use test, because yeah, but... you need to try it. Exactly, you have to try it, right? And when you try it, you continue handling, right? So you're handling, you're trying it and checking if it works for you or not. Okay, very good. Well, let's go to the conversation now. Let's move here. Okay, check. It says product testing are necessary I cannot read. No, no, no. Hmm. Says product testing are necessary procedures to be followed before deciding to create a new product. The following conversation features a group of managers in a meeting to discuss strategies for testing their new product. Yes. So you, de you design the product, you create it, and then you try it, right? You test it before you take it to the market. If no, you may have big problem, right? Okay, let's read the conversation, please. Good morning. I'm thrilled to announce we have green light to work on our latest product testing task. Repeat, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. I'm thrilled to announce. I'm thrilled, I'm thrilled to, to, announce. to announce. We have green light to work on our late latest product testing task. We have green light, green light to work on our latest product testing, testing task. One of the good things. One, of the, one of the room team. I like about working with you. 
I I know, I know about about working with you. you. Is all is the effort you make to do the job well? Is the effort oh, you make to do the job well? I agree with you, Mr. Ayala. I, I agree, agree with you, Mr. Ayala. Ayala. The efforts this task requires are important to take into account. The effort for this task requires are important to take into account. account. Definitely. 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 I have already written some ideas for a monadic test. So we can discuss them. Take a look. So we, so we can, can discuss, discuss them. them. Take a look. Good job. But have you figured out the cost? Good, Good job. Yeah. But you have you have you the cost? Some difficult decisions to make. Some, Some difficult, difficult decisions, decisions to, make. to make. Refer to the fancy material and cost versus quality. Refer to the fancy material and cost versus quality. quality. Yes, boss. Yes, boss. Yes, boss. One of the most important factors in this job. One of the most one important, of the most important factors, factors in this job. Is, this job is managing costs. <laughs> Is managing costs. It's managing costs. And I'm good at that. I'm good, good at, at that. that. Okay, one more time. Good morning. Good, good morning. morning. Good morning. I'm thrilled to announce we have green light to work on our latest product testing task. I'm thrilled to announce we, we have, have green light, light to work on our latest product testing task. Product testing task. One of the good things I like about working with you all. One of the good things I like about working, like about all, working with you all is the effort you make to do the job well. Is the effort you make to do the job well. I agree with you, Mr. Ayala. I agree with you, Mr. Ayala. The efforts this task requires are important to take into account. The efforts this task requires are important to take into account. Definitely. 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 I have already written some ideas for a monadic test. I have, I have already written, written some, ideas for, some ideas for the monadic test. So we can pass them. So we can, so we can discuss, discuss them. Take a look. Take, take, a, look. take, take a, look. a look. Good job. Beth, have you figured out the cost? Good, Good job. job. But, but have you figured out the cost? How the cost? Some difficult decisions to make. Some difficult decisions, difficult decisions to make. Decisions to make. To make. Refer to fancy material cost versus quality. Yes, boss. One of the most yes, important boss. factors in this job. Yes, boss. Yes, boss. One, one of the most important factors in this job is managing costs, and I'm good at that. Is managing costs, and I'm good at that. 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 Okay. Good. Do you think we have three people or it should be Mr. Ayala too? What do you think? Should we have three people in the conversation? ¿O será que se equivocaron y pusieron Mr. Ávila y seguía siendo Mr. Ayala? What do you think? I think it's, uh, uh, it was uh, three people. ¿Verdad? Yes. Yeah, because Mr. Ayala sounds like if he's uh, an extra person. Mm -hmm. 
who's the boss? Mr. Vélez. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Okay, so we're going to make groups of three. You go practice the conversation and then you answer this question. What product testing strategies mentioned in the conversation? What specific concern does Mr. Vélez have about the product? And what is Mr. Avila in charge of? Okay. Nice, nice. I'm going to send you in trios then. David, David, David. Eh, José. Ya, ya, ya está de regreso, sí. Yes. Ah, vaya, perfecto. Oops. Vamos a ver cómo quedamos aquí. Y José Alfredo ya llegó. No. Hola, no yet. Bueno. Bueno, lo voy a mandar. Vamos a ver eh, si todos se logran ir. Let's go, practice the conversation and then you answer the questions, right? There you go. Try to join. Adriana Marcela, try to join. José Alberto, Carla. José Alfredo, hello. Más o menos. <risa> Alero. <risa> ok. Comenzamos. Voy a ser yo, Mr. Ayala. Ah, ah. <risa> uh, y um, in, in the third part, uh -huh. Mr. Be Mr. Bell says, I agree with you, Mr. Ayala. And Yes, <laughs> okay. <laughs> in the first time, I am Mr. Ayala. Okay. Oh, Miss Ayala. Mr. Ayala. Mr. Ayala. Mr. It's Miss Ayala. Oh, sí, Miss Ayala. It's true. <laughs> okay. Sí. Entonces no. <laughs> That would be Carla. But uh, can be Mr. Ayala. Sí, pues, sí claro. But, uh, but in, in, this case, in this case, it's Mr. Ayala. Yeah. Only the first time. <laughs> Who's Mr. Vélez? I'm going to be Mr. Vélez. Okay. Carla, Mr. Avila. Miss Avila. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. Start. I going to start. Yes. Okay. Good morning. I'm thrilled to announce we have green light to work on our latest product testing task. One of the good things I like about working with you all. The effort you make to do the job. This does requires are important to take into account. Definitely. I have already written some areas for a monadic test so we can. I have already written some ideas. Ideas. 
some ideas. Written. Or a written. Mm -hmm. Vaya, pero me. Ay, pero el primero sí estaba bien, teacher. Definitely. De definitely. Como que tuviera acento en de. Definitely. 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 Mm -hmm. definitely. Definitely. I have ready written. Written. Some written. 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 Them. Some ideas. Some ideas for monadic test so we can discuss them. Take a look. Mm -hmm. Good job, but how do you figure or the cause? Some difficult decisions to make refer to fancy material and cost versus quality. Yes, boss. One of the most important factors is this job is managing cost and I'm good at that. Okay, okay. very good. Understood now, Grace. Very good. Okay. Good morning. I'm trying to announce we have green light to work on your last product testing task. One of the good things I like about working with you all in the effort you make to do the job well. I agree with you, Ms. Ariella. The efforts this task requires requires um, requires are important to take into account definitely i have already written definitely. some ideas definitely definitely definitely, definitely. This was one of the most important factors in this job is managing costs and i am good at that Soy novia. Ahí comienzo yo. Ajá, ok. Morning. I am thrilled and to announce we have green light to work on all last latest product testing tasks. One of the good things I like about working with you all is the effort you make to do that job well. I agree with you, Mr. Ayala. The efforts this tax requires are important to take into account. Definitely, I have already written some ideas for a monadic test, so we can decuse them. Take a look. Good job, but how do you figure it out the cost? Difficult decision to make refer to fancy material and cost versus quality. Yes, boss. One of the most important factors in this job is managing cost, and I I am good at that. Okay. So, busca el significado de esa palabra de managing. Managing. ¿Cómo se dice, teacher? Managing. No, la de monadic test. Monadic test. Ah, monadic test, monadic test. Solo dice que es una prueba monádica, pero no sé qué es eso. What is a monadic test? I don't know, teacher. I'm looking for the meaning in the internet. Okay. Dice que a monadic, a monadic test is where you show research participant one of product concept isolation. In isolation, o sea, solito. Isolation. You show research, uh, you show research participants one product or concept in isolation. Uh, it is opposite to comparison test. In the comparison test, you have two products. Uh, like imagine you say, hey, what pen is better? This big, <laughs> this is big too. Okay, this one or this one? Uh -huh. Right, so you're comparing. Vamos a ver este que no es big. 
So, which pen is better? The point, the pinpoint or the big? The pink point has a lighter point. It's very little and it's very fine. And the other one is a little thick. Okay, so you start comparing the two products. But in the monadic, no. You say, hey, I like this pen. It, it writes very well. It is not very difficult to write. You don't need to, to force your writing. Mm. And so you're, you're checking the characteristics of the product, but just one product alone, right? That's alone. You're not comparing the, the product with other products. You're just paying attention to the characteristics of that product and you're checking uh, for example, if I have a pen, I'm going to start using it, right? And grinding it. So that would be checking the product alone. That's why it says isolated. No comparing that product with another product. Yeah. That's why it says that it is the opposite of the comparison test. That in the comparison test, you're comparing two products, or probably three. In the monadic, no. You are studying only one product at a time, alone, okay. without making comparisons with other products. Okay. Sir, thank you. Mm -hmm. and, and I have another question. Donde dice, I'm thrilled to announce. Thrilled. 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 I'm thrilled to announce. Do you remember Michael Jackson? Oh, ah. Uh, ah, okay. Uh -huh. That's a uh, thrilled. I'm thrilled. To announce. So he, uh -huh. <laughs> so he says, love, está como que eh, no asustado, sino como sorprendido y emocionado al mismo tiempo. But yeah, we have green light to take, to test the product, right? We have green light. So they told them, you go, go, go ahead, you can do it, right? They gave them the green light. That's why he is amazed with that and he's thrilled about that, yeah? Okay. We have to answer the questions there. Yeah, you have to answer the questions. If you finish uh, practicing the conversation, you answer the question. Monadic uh, test. Okay. What is Mr. Avila in charge of? Mr. Avila. are in charge of the test of the uh, product. Ma or managing. Hi, nobody here? Or oh, you finished? Hello? Hi, teacher. Hi. Did Yo you soy... finish? No, todavía no. Y no, no pudimos trabajar porque, bueno, yo eh, hablé hace un ratito para presentarme con ellos, pero creo yo que no están. Y estoy justo ahorita por terminar mi clase, se recuerda, la de los lunes. Uh -huh, uh -huh. A las nueve. 
pero ya se pasó cinco minutos el catedrático. Sí. Entonces, uh, ya ahorita ya, ya me uno con ustedes. Ok. Entonces, ok. Creo, creo que no está, está solito Edwin. Edwin, hello. Edwin, Edwin, Edwin. Estoy todavía con el trabajo. Ay, Edwin. Ok. <risa> bueno. Vaya, vaya, vaya. Unos cinco minutitos más y me les uno. Ok. I, I have already written some, I, some ideas for a monadic test so we can discuss them. Take a look. Good job. But how do you figure it on the cost? Some difficult, Some difficult decisions. Ay, perdón, perdón. Dale, dale. No, le toca a usted, es parte del suyo. Some difficult decisions to make refer to fancy material and cost versus quality. Yes, but one of the most important factors in this job is managing cost, and I am, I am good with at that. Teacher, we have a question. Tell me. What is monadic test? Monadic test is a test uh, that you can pass to a product alone. That when you say isolated means that the product alone, I'm going to test this pen así, solito, sin ningún otro. Right? There is another test where you use comparison. You compare one, one pen with another pen that the company produces. But in the monadic, no, you're comparing only, or you're uh, testing only one product isolated in no relation with any other product. Alone, mm -hmm. alone, alone. Mm -hmm. As a random test or something like that. It's I, I, you're evaluating an, an isolated product. O sea, okay. un producto oh, lo evalúa solito. Uh -huh. Solito, okay. solito. Ah, ok, ok. Eh, quiero ver, solo, creo que solo eso teníamos de duda. Sí. Yeah. Uh -huh. Ok, thank you, teacher. Good, good. Ah, pues si quiere, empiezo yo la, la siguiente. Okay. Good morning, I'm thrilled to announce we have green light to work on our latest product testing task. One of the good things I like about working with you all is effort you make to do the job well. I agree with you, Mr. Ayala. The effort this task requires are important to take into account. Definitely. I have already written some ideas for a monadic test, so we can discuss them. Take a look. Good job. But have you figured out the cost? I'm going to call attendance before we continue. Let me see. Adriana Sofia. Present teacher. Analicia. I'm here teacher. Ana Grisel. David. Present teacher. Diego. Edwin Mauricio. 
Elda Cristina. Present teacher. Elmer Fabricio. Yvonne. Present. Grace Michelle. Grace Grace. Por ahí estaba, se nos perdió Grace. Jennifer Elizabeth. Jennifer. Jessica Lisette. Jessica. La vi que estaba conectada. Jessica, hello. Hello, hello, Jessica. No, verdad, no está. Eh, José Alberto. Present teacher. Karen Janet. Present teacher. Carla Lorena. Present teacher. Lisa Dayanara. Lisa Dayanara. Nubia. Present teacher. Grace okay. puso en el chat de WhatsApp. Present. Que Zoom la sacó de, de la plataforma. Oh, ok. Rebeca Marcela. Sí me extrañó que estaba en los grupos y, y después ya no, ya no me contestó. Estaba conmigo, teacher, y estábamos bien. Sí, 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 sí. Rebeca Marcela. Present teacher. Rosa Hilda. Present. Victor. Present teacher. Karen Stephanie. José Alfredo. Present teacher. Adriana Marcela. Present teacher. Nice, nice, nice. Alguien que no me haya contestado. Yo tengo un montón de ceros aquí. Karen Stephanie, no, ¿verdad? No está. Lisette Dayanara. Lisette Dayanara. No está Lisette Dayanara. No. Jessica. Jessica, Jessica. Jessica, hello. Jessica, ah. estamos despiertos, Jessica. Ay, ay, Jessica, no, me, no se me duerma, Jessica. Porfa. Sí, sí, se ve que tengo problemas con el Inter siempre, que, que llueve y está lloviendo acá. Mm. Okay. Jennifer Elizabeth, Jennifer, Jennifer, no, ¿verdad? Jennifer no está. Es que fíjense que yo veo como bastantes no me han dicho present. Vamos a ver, uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco. ¿Quién está? Karen Stephanie, no, ¿verdad? Elmer Fabricio. Bueno, a alguien le va a caer inasistencia porque no me dice present, pero no sé quién es. Que no me ha dicho present de lo que estoy llamando. Teacher, yo soy present, pero me saca Zoom porque está lloviendo y mi internet no está muy bueno. Pues ah. Le puse en el chat de WhatsApp 
porque por ratos me quedan reconectando y, o se escucha robotizado, entonces no escuché cuando me llamó. Sí, pero a usted ya le puse present. Ok, pero aquí estoy. Ay, qué chistosa la tiche, con 18, 19 conmigo. Eh, ahí está, pues sí, usted tiene que, estoy igual al chiste de los siete hermanos, yo. Más vacación quiere, tiche. Más vacación, sí, muy poquita fue. No alcanzó. <risa> otra semana va a ir buscando y por qué me salen pero sí, 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 sí si solo son 18 sí, son cinco los que están absent Pacha, ahí estamos pues let's see ya no Rosy, my vacation ok, vamos a ver tell me What product testing strategy is mentioned in the conversation? Monadic test. What is the monadic test? Uy, sorry. Hablando, hablando. Aha. Uh -huh. A monadic test is where you <coughs> research participant and product or concept in isolation. In isolated, yeah, in isolation. Isolation, perdón. Mm -hmm. So you have a product, you get the pros and cons of that product, you get the characteristics, the description, the complete thing about one product alone. Only one product without comparing the product with other products, right? So I'm not comparing my product with other products, I just check the, the advantages, disadvantages, the characteristics. So what are the things I can do with that product? What I cannot do? Eh, what it means to improve, pero sin compararlo con otros, right? That's the monadic eh, test. Okay, what a specific concern does Mr. Vélez have about the product? What is his concern about the product? Mm -hmm. The material and cost versus quality. Exactly. So you have fancy material because you want the, the, the product to look fancy. But what about the quality mm, and the cost, right? So those are the concerns that Mr. Vélez has about the product. What is Mr. Avila in charge of? What about Mr. Avila? What is he He's in charge of? Coast. He's in charge of? Coast. Coast. Repeat, repeat, repeat. Managing costs. Mm -hmm. He's in charge of managing costs. Uh-huh. And he's good at that, right? He's good at managing costs. So it's like, okay, don't worry, Mr. Vélez, right? Don't worry about the costs. Worry about the quality. Because the costs, I can do them, right? I can fix that. Okay. Well, now we have time. Let me show you. Um, What is, what is the importance of testing? Why testing a product? Why? Why is it so important? I'm going to upload a, show it here. I'm going to send you the material that we're going to be using. I'm going to check, I'm uploading it there in the chat. See. Check. Uh, testing is, essential, is an essential part of developing a quality product. Remember we were saying before that when you are uh, designing or making a product before you launch it to the market, 
you have to test it. Check if the product has good quality. What form of test will you use? That's your decision. And of course, it will depend on the type of product, right? Uh, it helps manufacturers create products that are reliable. What is reliable? What does it mean? Hmm? Yeah, le digo. That you can make it. Okay, something that you can trust, right? If, for example, if you tell me that you can take a big pen and it doesn't matter what you want to do, a big pen will not let you there saying, oh, no, mi lapicero ya no escribió, right? So that's the fame that big pens have. That it doesn't matter uh, all the documents that you want to write. The best pen you can rely is a big. It's cheaper than others, but it's one of the best, right? So we can say that this pen is reliable because if I have to complete a lot of documents, I should have one of this, right? This will probably stop grinding from one moment to another, but this one, it's reliable. So uh, it helps manufacturers create products that are reliable within certain technical standards. In other words, Testing is a necessary step for product development teams to go through to provide high quality products. So you have a product, you have a team, right? A team that develops a product. So you want to provide a, a high quality product, test your product. Remember what I was telling you before about uh, manipulating the product in a rude way. If you think or if you know that the product will be used in that form, because that way you know if your product will really last, because that's the, the thing. High quality products that last. Que duran, right? For example, uh, there are some types of shoes that you say, oh, hasta me aburrí de ellos. And they were still in good condition when I took them out, right? But they are high quality products that have been tested, right? Perhaps most importantly, product testing can ensure that an item is safe for general use. So imagine I buy a product that you tell me, you know what? You can go into the water with this uh, watch, but it was not tested in the water. Can that be safe for me to go into the water with that watch? Probably no. Probably it will get damaged, right? But if it was try, it was tested in the water, you can tell me, you know what? You can go into the water, you can go to the swimming pool with that watch on and nothing will happen to it, right? So these three things are very important, right? And you have that when you test a product. Check the document I share with you. Uh, I'm going to make different groups. So, I'm going to make six groups. First group, you're going to talk about the first two things, value of product testing. So we have one value is that it shows your product's limit. The other value, it detects potential issues early. We're talking about product testing, right? And also another value of product testing is that it helps boost your brand. And the last one is, you will give me some tips. So uh, group number one, you're going to talk about these two points. Group number two, 
you talk about three and four. And then we will talk about four reasons why product testing is important for manufacturers. And we will have another group telling me about number one, it gives insight into system level functions. And the other one, find out what your product can endure. And group number four, you will tell me, oh, catch product defects early on. So before you launch them or you send them to the market, you, de you detect, right? Or the defects that it may have. And then you talk about quality assurance. Let's see how many we are. I'm going to stop sharing. You have the document uh, with you. I'm going to make four groups. And each of you will have, remember you go directly to the information for you, right? Let's see, okay. José Alfredo. Hola, teacher. Ya llegué ya, a mi casa. Ya llegó. Perfecto. Va. Vaya, vamos a ver. Edwin. Edwin, 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 Edwin. Hello. I'm teacher. I'm still in, in work. You're working, Edwin. Vaya, ahí van a estar tres. En el, bueno, quedan cuatro, 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 tres. ¿Verdad? Eh, ok. Vaya. Check. Group number one, Ana, Alicia, Jessica, José Alberto y Rosa Hilda. You go for one and two. ¿Se acuerdan lo que les mostré, verdad? Values, values of product testing, one and two. ¿Sí? Eh, Adriana, Marcela, José Alfredo, Carla, Lorena y Rebeca. You go for values of product testing three and four. Adriana, Sofía, David, Edwin, and Karen. You go for the four reasons of product testing, one and two. And Elda, Cristina, Yvonne, Nubia, and Victor. You go for reasons three and four. ¿Estamos? Questions? No questions? No. No, no. teacher. Bye. Perfect. Vámonos, pues. Read the information and get ready to share. Okay? Try to join. Join, join, join. No, pero yo le tomé captura. Yo tengo la, la importance of product testing. No. El, el uno, it shows your product limits. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Uh -huh. El problema es que le tomé captura, pero no lo encuentro. Pero aquí dice el number one. It shows your product limits. Yeah. Me imagino que primero lo vamos a leer, ¿verdad? Yes. Since the very beginning, important of product testing. Ah, uh, espérame que ha mandado algo al, al WhatsApp, ¿verdad? Sí. Ahí no. está en el, en el documento de WhatsApp. Sí, ahorita lo veo. Bueno, a ver si lo puedo abrir. Si no me lo mando a mi correo y lo abro aquí. Yo no tengo WhatsApp en, el, en la compu. 
Yo no tengo Word, no tengo licencia de Word. Pero ah, espérame, yo te lo mando entonces, no hay problema. Voy a Perfecto. tratar de compartirlo yo. Espérame, me si está... Sí, me abrió. Ah, ¿Ah sí abrió. No, no es eso. Espérame, o oh, está en el mismo documento de un ejercicio que hicimos, quizás, ¿verdad? No, no me abrió eso. Si lo Se quieren mira. ver más grande, sí. si lo quieren ver más grande. That one, that's okay. Mm. Ah, sí, está bien. Bye. Sería number one, ¿verdad? It mm -hmm. shows your product limit. Alicia. Hello. No nos vaya a mostrar algo que no, porque se está moviendo. Yes, because I'm recording. Ah. No, este, José, ¿Quién está, José, ¿verdad? ¿O quién está yo, compartiendo? Yo estoy compartiendo. compartiendo. Oh, José, bueno. si gusta, me sí. da chance y lo comparto. No, it's bye, okay. Bye. Es chocolate. No hay problema. Eh, product testing. Types. How you can how can you maximize the result of your product testing? Identify your target market and consider that what they want in the product. Determine their expectations and test your product if it meets their requirements. Identify what you want to test about your product. Focus on, on the essential functions when doing so. Consider the native environments of your consumers. The native, oh. native, native environment. Yeah, native. Oh, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Native, okay. No sé si Rebeca o José Alfredo quieren leer lo demás. Lo voy a leer yo. Is your product temperature sensitive? Uh, consider the climate of the target market. Select a group of random people who will test your product. Make sure they don't have teas with anyone from your company. Make them feel relaxed during the testing and encourage, and encourage them to give a real time comments during the process. Use, use related tools, tools for a create result. Okay, now what do we think about? Three and four. <laughs> Um, I think the, the number four, the product testing tips, is the como the, test, the final testing about the product. Did the, you evaluate the, with the other user? Uh, with the different on the other with the people with not working in the in the company. So to evaluate the result and, and the climate on, on no sé, dependiendo del ambiente, the environment. The environment. Environment. Environment with the you made the test. To evaluate another expected expectativa. The expectation. The expectation. Uh, I think number four is very important too, because it says that you can have a the real opinion for the people that is gonna that is gonna use it as that say, are going to use it. That are gonna, uh, mm -hmm. as here uh -huh. said. Consider the climate 
of your climate, target market. Climate. 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 climate of your target market. So uh, you have to select a, a group of random people who will test the product. So these people is not gonna lie about the way that they perceive the product. So I think it's very important for no, for Teacher. Hi. One question. Tell me. Uh, what's the, what is the, ¿Qué es lo que en realidad es un resumen de las dos partes que, que no mencionó? Sí. You have to read it uh -huh. and then summarize it. You will share with your partners like the most important of, of the two things that you're reading. Okay. Mm -hmm. Only selection, the, the most important. The, yeah, the you... It's like you read the information and then you share it with the rest in using your own words, right? Okay, that's it. You go for reasons, right? Reasons why yes. product testing is important for manufacturers. And number one and number two, the four reasons. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Okay. In our case, uh, Adriana uh, is the number one, is the functionality of your product on its own is beneficial, I think. And uh, it is the import to ensure that the tested product does not inhibit any moving parts in the system. I think so. What do you think? I didn't understand. Can you repeat, please? Um, what is the more important? The Wait, you are talking about the the most important things about this photograph. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. What do you think the, what is the more important? The first part of while tasting the functionality of your product on its own is beneficial. That is the most important mm -hmm. as, as you. Is it sure? One, one moment, please. Okay, I think. So, yeah. These are the beneficial. Okay. I think is the part. Do. Where I say you should first determine what the goal of the system is and if your product is working to meet this goal. Hello. Okay. I think the functionality of your product on its own in beneficial. I think the functionality mm -hmm. the mass. Mm 
the import the important fields uh -huh. that determine uh -huh. uh -huh. Uh -huh. The import, the important determiner is your product. Is is this? Product. Ajá. Esto usted ya dijeron, ¿verdad? Los beneficios. This product. Is working to meet the goal of the system. Okay. The product, please. The important is determine if this product is this mm -mm. Mm -hmm. it's product. import Which application a reputation of the company. Yes. That's, that's and, a reason. And mm -hmm. other thing that is important is that they say um, this is especially true in a medical industry. In order for products like like orins and seals, uh, it can be super important for a um, medical like a, a jarabe or or Cairo. A, a uh, or alcohol or liquid uh, medicine. Yes. It's to make the, the medicine be safe or, or I don't know. Yes. If manufacturers don't catch uh, products the first early on, um, and it a, an appears a defect when it is on the market, uh, there is a process called uh, recollect. There is a recollect, and that is more expensive than at the cost to produce all um, batch of products. So for, that's the reason why it is very important to catch the first early on. Okay. Okay, I want to comment about the quality assurance when is manufacturing medical products. Uh, there are as uh, uh, many a uh, many kind of tests. Um, how do you say auditorias? Auditoria. Um, for example, McDonald's, if you product 
So it manufacture. Manufacture. That's an audit. audit. Okay. Uh -huh. For example, if you manu uh, manuf manufacture some product for McDonald's, McDonald's uh, send you um, a team of, of auditors to check the process, to check the, the cleanest, yes, to, to the material uh, quality and uh, the, the process, the whole process. Produce to, the... Yes, to ensure the quality of the of the products. That's, that's all. Are, that, you, that's, are you ready? To come in with the group? Uh-huh, yes. Yes, yes. <laughs> so, so. Yeah. so, so, vámonos pues. Um, Let's go. Okay, Bacha. I guess, yeah, we're all here. Room number one, you will tell me about a values of product testing. It shows your product's limits and it detects potential issues early. Okay. Well, we were talking about uh, it shows your product limits it means that you are going to put the product in limit conditions. Mm -hmm. For example, temperature, eh, environment, temperature levels. Eh, if the product survive in that condition, it means that eh, we have a good product. But, be, but before, leave the product in the marketplaces, you have to do this, this testing, uh, this way of testing the products, put the product at the limit. For example, uh, Jose was telling us about the uh, waterproof clocks, for example. Mm -hmm. uh, you have to know how many pounds under the water you can be for example and in when you know that you can say okay you only uh, get in the water like 15 feet or something for example mm -hmm. uh, if you go more deep than 15 feet your uh, clock or watch, it's going to be broke or fail or whatever. For example, that it means uh, put your products, it shows your product limits, number one. And number two, we were reading and we didn't finish, but we understood that uh, Early performance product, you have to notice a 
the as the as they say the potential issues that the product will have and resolve it resolve it them during the early stage of production okay before you send it to the market right of course of course before you send the product to the marketplace you have to know uh, the potential issues and in mejora in improve all that potential issues okay okay and later on you won't have problems uh, related to clients right or customers saying hey you know what this product doesn't work this mm -hmm. is not a good product mm -hmm. so you will avoid so, that issue right what they are saying is that you have to put the product in different scenarios aha uh -huh. uh, that can show you how the product it works in different uh, situations <laughs> and the problems that it may face right uh -huh. yes yes okay thank you you're welcome thank you thank you no, group number two, Adriana Marcela, Jose Alfredo, Carla, Lorena, Rebecca. You're talking about catch product defects early on? No. No, 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 no. It, it helps boost your brand and the tips, right? Yes, teacher. Okay. Uh, we was talking about number three. Where? We, we, were. we were talking about number three, number four, and uh, we think that number three is uh, like the product testing internal for mm -hmm. the team knows about uh, if the product uh, confirm the quality, confirm the the idea that the team has and number four is the way that the team know if the product is how the product is gonna be uh, accept accepted 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 by the by the target that they they consider because uh, it says that uh, you you uh, select a run a group of random people for test the product. So that's the the way that the people that you you're gonna know if the product is good for the people. So uh, three and four are like internal and external testing of the product. Okay. Thank you, thank you, Adriana. Any other tip? Okay, let's go to group number three, Adriana, Sofia, David, Edwin, and Karen, Janet. You're talking about the first two reasons. Gives insight and finds out what the product can endure. Hello? Okay, teacher, the number one, the gives insight into system level function. And the first is the determinate what is the goal of the system, uh, the functionality uh, of your product on its own is a beneficiary. Okay. And uh, find on what your product can endure is a manufacturer's uh, and introduction real situation that they product. Mm -hmm. it's, it not, it's not the same to, to have it just like a, like, a, like using it little, right? But when you take them to the real situation where you're going to use it, uh, then the reality is totally different. 
Mm -hmm. Continue, David. And the, and the introduce the rare situation that they the product is uh, the phase during their life cycle. Mm -hmm. And uh, with the, uh, the manufacturing should introduce uh, the materials uh, and the light salt water on the other qualification of uh, qualification of the product. Okay, very good. Thank you, David. And then we go with no group number four, Elda, Yvonne, Nubia, and Victor. Uh, talking about catch product defects early on and the quality assurance. Okay. Uh, we were talking about the catch product defect early on. Um, okay. It's very important to for our company, our manufacturer, detect uh, the defect of the product. Uh, the danger of potential, potential danger or serious injuries could be applied to the manufacturer if a product is uh, defective, defective in the market. So that is important to minimize, minimize the risk for the manufacturers and distributors. Uh, when the product is sold in the market about or throughout um, a distributor, distributor, the responsibility uh, is on the manufacturer ever. And um, what's about the quality assurance? It's um, it's applied when you or when when the manufacturers and produce medical products, it's necessary to be or to make a very test, very or various various testing before to launch this product to the market. It's necessary to meet some uh, requirements uh, to, to, to launch the product to the market before. Uh, there are serious or uh, various grades to the medical test that's necessary to apply when the uh, produ uh, manufacturers produce medical, uh, uh, medical products. Um, when a product is defective in the market, it could be, could be, um, podría ver? There could be. Uh, there could be a process, a process of recall. And that is very expensive. Um, Sometimes it's, it's more expensive than uh, a cost of the produce of a whole batch of product. That's that's all. I don't know if any 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 other of my team would report something. Mm -hmm. That's the quality assurance. So remember, uh, they are talking about el ISO 9000. Do you remember later on? Uh, yes. Yes. So there were like. Uh, you are assuring that your product is the best one. And when you're talking about medical things, the tests are like even more strict, right? Because you have you are worried about the security of people also. Yes. Okay. Well, thank you, Victor. Thank you very much. Okay. Well, that's product testing. I'm going to stop sharing. I don't know if you have any questions. What are some strategies that we can think of when testing a product? What do you think? 
Mm -hmm. What are some strategies to take into account? First, I will say analyze, check what is the best type of test depending on the product, right? Depending on the product that you're testing, that's the type of test that you will need. Mm -hmm. What else can you add just to close? Only one? O ya estamos pensando más en la camita. Vamos a ver. No, 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 DJ, I don't have idea. Uh -huh. De lo que hemos estado hablando este día. Vaya. For example, in number one, we were talking about that we have to put the product and to one one strategy is put the product at limits mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and the other one is the durability about the of the product okay yes and remember Remember that testing a product should be before you launch the product to the market to avoid problems later on, right? If no, uh, we may have situations that you have to recall the product. That means take the product back because it is um, it has malfunctioning or any other issue. Right, so to avoid issues with your product, first to test it. That's why we have to identify the potential issues about mm -hmm. the product. See, and you do that when you test the product. While you're testing, imagine you have uh, some material that you stretch, it is supposed to stretch. But when you do this, it's it gets broken, right? So you say like, oops, that's an issue that I have to correct before I take it to the market, yeah? What about you take a car and when you start driving, you're driving the car in the, in the street that is beautiful here in the city, but you're selling your car to go to the countryside. And when you start in the street, driving in a street with a lot of rocks, your car starts like crashing, right? That's a good way of testing your car. So you're testing the product according to what you want the product to be used, right? How is your product going to be used? You test it that way. So that's why you were saying, test, take it to the limit. Quiero que sea un producto fuerte, lo voy a probar así. Right? That's why you see uh, many products that they hit the product, they stretch it, they put it in machines that will manipulate the product in a very rude way so that at the end they say, like, hmm, okay, it will last and it will be a uh, the, the the person or the customer can do whatever with this product and it won't get damaged so fast, right? If no, you really have an issue there. Okay, bueno, we continue talking about product testing during the rest of the unit. That tomorrow is grammar. No se me pierdan. Tomorrow we will be talking about subject verb agreement. That's a very important topic about grammar. Okay. Vamos a ver, Adriana, Sofía, here. Present teacher. Ana Alicia. Present teacher. Ana Grisel. No, ¿verdad? David. Present teacher. Diego Batres. Present. Edwin Mauricio. Present teacher. 
Edwin hoy se queda conmigo. Elda Cristina. Present teacher. Elmer Fabricio. Grace. Ivonne Marcela. Present. Jennifer Elizabeth. Jessica Lisette. José Alberto. Present teacher. Karen Janet. Present teacher. Carla Lorena. Present teacher. Lisette Dayanara. Nubia Suleima. Present teacher. Rebeca Marcela. Present teacher. Rosa Hilda. Present teacher. Victor. Present teacher. Karen Stephanie. Karen. Karen, Karen. Adriana Marcela. Present teacher. José Alfredo. Present teacher. Ok. Vaya. Eh, bueno, bueno. Nos vamos. See you, see you. Have a nice. See you, night. see you. A dormir. Good night. 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 See you tomorrow. Good night. Bye bye. Tomorrow. Bye bye. Hi, Edwin. Do you have any questions, Edwin? Tiene cerrado el micrófono. Y yo luciéndome con el inglés. <laughs> <laughs> I hear some, something about the test, the product, um, y, and some definitions. Uh, but uh, for the work, it's very difficult. Uh, yeah. 100%. Yes, uh, I know. I know. But it's very interesting. The, uh, uh, the class of today, and it's very com like uh, industrial engineering. Yeah. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. And entrepreneur entrepreneurs too. Uh -huh. yeah. So as we're talking about a new product and a new business, right? Uh -huh. And when you're creating a new product, it is very important to make after designing it, making the product, you have to test it to see if it really does what it is supposed to, to do. Mm -hmm. uh, is a part for the launch. Uh -huh. uh, show, show to the customer. Uh, they prove the product. Any any way uh, food uh, uh, machine. Maybe a perform. Uh huh. Exactly. Mm -hmm. When they give the sample, right? Sample. Uh, that is a way of marketing the product. But you can also uh, get some random people to test the product, and you say, "Vaya, tome, lleves esto, pruébelo y vuelve y me cuenta." So that's a good way of of having a, a, a testing without cost. As you remember, Mr. Avila, he said, oh, I am good at <laughs> the checking the costs of the product, right? Mm -hmm. So that way uh, you can check or you can test the product without spending too much money. Mm -hmm. Because Mercadeo. Ajá, en marketing. Marketing, y está eh, 
laborando ahí en, en centros penales. Okay. Ellos este, promueven lo que fabrican ahí okay. y se ven unas cosas que, ¿no? por ejemplo, unas pinturas, unos cuadros que hacen y los promueven, promueven los cultivos, promueven el pan, promueven muchas cosas. Lo okay. hacen ahí en el, en el tabernáculo aquí de okay. San Salvador. Uh -huh. That's nice. And they had to test the products that they make. Mm -hmm. There's the site. Uh, site hand, site yeah. and handling. Handling. Site and handling. Yeah. Not always can be used uh, the other one of using the product, right? But you can use handle, for example, in the case of the of the of the paintings that they do, that will be. Sight mm -hmm. and handling test. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Well. No more questions. Teacher. Okay, perfect. Well, uh, have a good night, Jen, Edwin, and see you, you. tomorrow. Okay. Yes. See you tomorrow. Okay, see you tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Take mm -hmm. care. Take care.